Okay, today I want to introduce you to a push to connect slip ball valve. So here is a slip style push to connect ball valve. You'll notice it has an elongated body on one side. This allows you to slide or slip the ball valve onto one side of the copper pipe. And then once you get the other side of the ball valve lined up with the other side or other piece of pipe, you simply slide the ball valve up onto the other pipe into place. These work great for tight confined spaces or in a situation where you need to add a ball valve and you don't want to solder or you can't solder and the pipe doesn't have a lot of give or an ability to move either section of pipe up or down away to get the ball valve in place. Push to connect ball valves are also plumbing code compliant. So here is the tools I need to install this slip push to connect ball valve, scotch bright pad, a rimming tool, tubing cutter, Sharpie, and an install removal tool. So here's the situation. I have this copper pipe and I can't, and I can't move either side of the pipe up or down. There's no wiggle room. You can see the pipe comes through the floor. It's rigid. I don't have an ability to go down and move it. And up top, you can see the other side of the copper pipe. If we follow it, goes up, 90s over, attaches to the water inlet, Coming through the water meter, I can't move that either. This, I'll simply push it on. See, it slides way down. And I'll use that orange install and removal tool now. Attach it to the pipe, slide that removal tool underneath that push to connect ball valve. I'm gonna make a mark on my copper pipe. Push up on the tool, which will push up on the ball valve and I'll be able to make my connection. And the mark I made with the Sharpie, make sure I get it pushed in far enough. And there we go. Repair has been completed. It's that easy. Wow. And then we'll turn the water on, check for leaks. And be sure to clean the pipe inside and out before you install that push to connect ball valve because you do not want to nick or damage the O-rings inside the ball valve. There it is installed. Please like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment, and thanks for watching.